With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let us start with our question. In this question, what is given that there is a spherical hole which is made in the solid sphere of radius capital R. The mass of the sphere before holding was capital M. Now we need to find what is the gravitational field at the center of the uh, hole due to the remaining mass. Okay. So first of all, we just define, for example, if this is our solid sphere, we are just taking out the cavity. So the best way to uh, this uh, deal with this situation is, is to consider this sphere, uh, this whole problem to be consisting of, let's say this is a sphere. Okay. And here there is a, uh, 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 this uh, uh, cavity or we can say that there is a mass which is placed here, which is the, this is the mass which is placed here, but it is having a mass density as to be negative row. For example, if this is having a mass density of positive row, so we can just consider that this is having a mass density of negative row. So to as to make the cavity. So if we put this portion onto this part, onto this part, so then minus row and plus row would be cancelled. So it would be just zero. That means there is a cavity which we have formed. Okay. Now this is the simple way how to, uh, how we treat the cavity problem. Now, now we can see that electric field at this point, we need to find at the center of the, at the center of the hole, we need to find what is the electric field at this point. Okay. So electric field at this point would be due to this shaded region. We call this has to be one and due to the cavity, due to two. Now due to cavity, it is exactly at the center. So due to ca cavity, there won't be any magnetic field here. Okay. Why? Because magnetic, uh, this, sorry, gravitational field, gravitational field at the center, at the center of a sphere, it is equal to zero. So we have considered this to be a sphere. So here due to this sphere, the magnetic field or we can say that due to cav cavity, uh, this uh, sorry, gravitational field uh, would be equal to zero. Now this is one of the case. That means the gravitational field, which we are denoting G at the center, let's say this at the center C would be just, uh, we just uh, represent the magnitude. It would be just due to the uh, this uh, uh, gravitational field of the shaded portion, which we have termed as to be one. Okay. It would be as simple as that. Now, how can we treat the problem? So to treat this uh, gravitational field uh, due to this, uh, this uh, solid portion at, at this point. So what we can do, we can just draw a sphere here. Okay. Now this sphere would be at a distance of R by two because the center of this cavity is at a distance of R by two. So we just say that it would be at a distance of R by two. Now, it is very simple. Now, what would be the gravitational field at this point due to this sphere? We can say that it would be very simple. It would be equal to G, the mass of this portion, the mass of this portion, we call this as to be M dash divided by the distance. So distance would be equal to R divided by two. So it is equal to R divided by two square. So this is how we write G. G value would be equal to capital G M divided by R square, where M is the mass. Okay. R is the distance. What is this mass? Which would be enclosed by a, uh, uh, by a surface. We call this has to be a gravitational surface which we have found. It is just similar to the gravitational, sorry, electrical flux which we used to calculate in the uh, this uh, Gauss law. Now we just need to substitute what is the value of the m dash. So what is this value m dash? We can say that mass would be equal to m dash would be equal to density times volume. Now what is uh, this uh, volume? Volume would be equal to four by three pi and what is the radius of this uh, this portion it would be r divided by 2 so it would be r by 2 cube or we can say that it would be equals to uh, rho 4 by 3 pi r cube okay this would be the case and 1 divided by 2 cube we can write it 1 divided by 8 now what is this value rho into 4 by 3 pi r cube so this is the total volume multiplied by the density would be giving us the total mass so we say that our m dash would be equals to the total mass divided by 8. Now we can put the value. So gravitational field or we can say that uh, this uh, G at the center, this would be equals to G into M divided by 8 divided by R by 2 square. That means R square by 4 or we can say that it would be equals to G M divided by 2 R square. So which option is the correct option? G M divided by 2 R square. C would be the correct option. Hope you understood this solution. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.